What, what on earth did she sent me? Um. <laughs> That's right guys, Ryan here with Data Patrol today with another video. I've got some P.O. Box pickups, one of them from California and one of them from England. So let's go ahead and check these out. Got this one right here I actually purchased from Display Geek. They put something up on Instagram and I said, I kind of need that for the collection. This is a very, very cool pop. So I wanted to pick that up. And this is from uh, Irish Jenny on uh, in Instagram. And uh, I don't know what she, I have no idea. I don't know. I recently got a huge package from Silver Fox from England as well with a huge pile of, it, check the video right there. You're gonna wanna see that. So I am very curious to see what's in this box. Well, let's go ahead and open this up. Got my knife, let's open this bad boy up. Guys, if you haven't checked out Display Geek, they have some of the most amazing displays for Funko Pops that that exist. I mean, honestly, they just, they just do. Uh, I'll put a link to them in the description below. Definitely check them out and uh, check the other store. Now they carry pops as well, but they also have these displays that are freaking awesome. So if you're looking for a cool way to display your pops, definitely check them out. So they got me a nice display geek little card there going on. And this is kind of like what they got going on. In box collector, out of box collector, they got different displays. They got some really cool stuff. All right, so this pop right here, I'm excited about this one, guys. I really, I don't know why I don't already own this, but I saw it, I had to pull the trigger, it was an impulse buy. I had to get it, I had to get it, this is awesome. So, uh, let's see, we got some good packaging material going on here. Ooh, got some tissue paper. He always packages stuff well, man, I'm telling you. I mean, look, look at the, look at this. It's good stuff, guys. It's good stuff. I'm excited about this one. I really am. Dude. Guys, we got King Felix. Another one from my MLB line. Check this out. We are definitely taking this out of the box because you got to appreciate this one out of box. Look at that. Seattle Maris, Felix Hernandez, King Felix. There were a couple different variants of this pop uh, that uh, go went way up in value. Like some of them are super, super rare. Uh, I don't have those. I have this one. And um, honestly, this was a pretty good deal he had on his website for this. So I went ahead and picked this up. And uh, I'm happy to have it in the collection. But I will tell you, there's a good look at the box without the protector on it. Uh, the box art is awesome. I love these MLB pops. Safeco Field exclusive. You had to go to a particular ball game to be able to pick up this pop. So that's one reason why I didn't have it off the bat. Because you know what? I don't live on the West Coast. And so I didn't get it. But uh, I do have it now. It's heavy too. It's like it's solidly heavy. And I am super excited, guys. I don't know if anybody out there is excited about these new MLB mascot lines coming out. They announced a Toy Fair. <laughs> I am. I am super excited about this. Holy crap. Look at this thing. Oh boy. Guys, King Felix. Check it out. Look at this pop. This thing is crazy, crazy cool. Look at that crown, dude. Wow, I I like it, guys. I like it quite a bit. Look, look at the robe. He's got the scepter with the baseball. I mean, just all around. Look at this. Love it. Love it. Love it. Love it. Love it. This is gonna be. This has got to be an out of the box pop. I mean, it's just, you can't put this back in the box. It's just so freaking awesome. So awesome, man. Look at the. Look at just look at the detail on the baseball and the scepter. I mean, just, just crazy, crazy, crazy cool. Man, that's awesome. Oh, Display Geek, thank you very much, man. Thank you. I, this, I'm really happy to have this in collection. I really am. I'm trying my best to get all the MLB pops. I'm, I'm doing my best now. There's a lot of park exclusives that are very hard to get. There's some that are like, they only made 19 of that are stupid money, $3,000, $4,000. That's, that's, I just want a variant of whatever they got. So that's kind of what it is. So this one right here, um, I'm just happy to have it, man. I'm not even gonna put him back in the box. He's gonna stay out of the box. I'm gonna put him right there. Let's see what Irish Jenny sent me from the UK, guys. This it's it's heavy. No idea. All, the only thing she told me on Instagram was that I was gonna like it. That's all I know. That's it. That's it. So we're definitely going to uh, open this thing up. It's got some serious tape on there. I can tell you that. Let's see what Irish Jenny has sent to us. Let's see. I'm I'm gonna look. Is that cool with you guys? I'm gonna, I'm gonna take a sneak peek. Well, I'm going to try to. What? What on earth did she send me? Um. 
Now, okay, all right, all right. I know you guys can't see this, all right. So I got a, I got a card, let's see what the card is. Uh, <laughs> you guys, man, you guys are killing me. That's awesome. All right, it says, hello, Ryan. I hope you're doing okay, love your videos. Thank you very much, I really appreciate it. By the way, if you haven't subscribed, hit the button, that's all I'm saying. Uh, you will find some tea for your wife in the parcel since you mentioned she loves tea. Oh, she will be very happy about that. I also got you some sweets from Germany since I'm German, and I hope you like them. Now, why is your name Iris Jenny if you're... Um, see? I don't get it. Okay. Uh, in the white box are something... two or two pops. The hand rags. Not... Okay. It's my fault. I can't read. Uh, two pops for you. I'm sure you will be happy to have them. All the best, Jeanette. Jeanette, you are awesome. Thank you very much. I will add this to my wall of letters, by the way. If you guys don't know, I have a P.O. box in the description below. Check it out. You can send me letters. Like, just send me letters, and I'll read them here on the channel, and we'll see what happens. All right, so um, right off the bat, I can tell you she got me some more hobnobs. So I really enjoy these things with coffee. Now, I know people drink these with tea. I get it. I get it. But I like them with coffee. I like my coffee. Uh, so happy to have some of those as well. And uh, we put those right there. We got, all right, morning, noon, and night. This is natural caffeine-free red bush tea for bright days, peaceful nights. So there we go, guys. This is for Mrs. Jetta. She will definitely appreciate that. And we're gonna have her taste some of this stuff. We're gonna do a huge taste test and video for the stuff you guys have been sending me uh, very soon with her. She has agreed to do it. She agreed to do it, so maybe we'll make her some tea in that like Aladdin lamp that we got the other other week. Um, so we'll definitely try that. All right, so we got some tea. We got some. Uh oh, got tape. Got tape. All right, what is this? We got some choco. All right, so this is German, um, and I'm gonna butcher that name, so I'm not even gonna... Leibniz. Leibniz. I'm <laughs> terrible. Milk chocolate. This looked like uh, chocolate wrap crackers. More chocolate than a biscuit. So there we go. We're gonna try those out. And what, ooh. I think Mrs. Jetta would like this. I think she'd like this. Um, hazelnut and caramel with creamy nougat and chocolate. A toffee. So we got a toffee. And like I said, these are German chocolates, so we're super happy to try these out. Toffees. If anybody knows what these are, had these, comment down below, let me know and like which ones would be your favorite out of the set that she sent us. Um, hey, this, I, I'm, I'm intrigued by this one, honestly. This looks pretty tasty. Along with the hobnobs, which I already know I like. I already know I like those. Um, this is hazelnut in a caramel cup with hazelnut chocolate filling topped with chocolate. Like that, that sounds pretty tasty. Toffee. Oh man, all right. All right, so then she's got two. Oh, wow. Okay. We got a box in a box. That's awesome. All right, let me grab. Got the knife. All right, let's open this thing up. Uh, she got a tape. Oh, it's not taped. I don't even need a knife. All right, go down there. Ah! All right, you ready? All right. I thought I was going to be able to see what it was, but no, there's <laughs> And paper in it. All right, all right, all right, all right come on. Uh, what? What? Really? Wow. That's awesome. That's, that's awesome. You were right. I did not have them, and I do like them. Thank you very much. All right, so hold on. Um, how am I going to get them out of here? They're packaging them so well. Like, they're like bubble wrap and soft protectors, and like, there's no... How am I... Nope, that didn't work. The suspense is killing you, because I already know what it is, so it's not killing me. Uh, but I will tell you, very, very, all right. She's packaged it very well. All right, so come on. You can do it. You can do it. Just open the box, Jetta. I'm trying. All right, here we go, guys. Like, look at that packaging job. She, wow. So guys, we got uh, Albus Dumbledore from the new Harry Potter line. Look at that. I did not have a Dumbledore pop anywhere in the collection. Look at that. What a cool pop. What a cool pop. And I've said it before, I really, really like the artwork on the box design for this new wave. I just I just really like it. That is a super cool pop. Mm-mm-mm. That's awesome. Thank you. Thank you, thank you, thank you. We got one more in here, guys. Let's... Oh, almost dropped it. I'll put... I was right there. 
Stay. Oh, we got one more. All right, so uh, you guys can see what it is. It's the other one. She sent me two Dumbledore pops, guys. Look at that, guys. We got the original one. Number four in the Harry Potter line, Alba's Dumbledore. Look at that. How cool is that? Jeanette, you are awesome. Very, very kind. You definitely didn't need to send me all this stuff. That is crazy, crazy cool. Um, I, honestly, the letter means a ton. I, I love letters. I love them. Um, and to send me two Harry Potter pops that I needed for the collection is very, very kind of you. I mean, just awesome. This is awesome, guys. This is awesome. Guys, comment down below. Let Jeannie know how awesome she is. And let me know, like, which one of these you think are going to be my favorite. Is it going to be these, the Hobnobs, the Toffees? I'm definitely going to get Mrs. Jetta to try this tea. We're going to do it live on camera so you can get her thought on that thing. I'm telling you, super happy, guys. As always, remember to collect what you like. We'll see you in the next video.